Hello everyone, welcome to eKeda platform and this is Ravind Jangit here, your electrical faculty and in this video I'm going to talk about a numerical which is actually based on the your overlapping angle. Before reading this, you can say the numerical, the first thing, first thing keep in mind that whenever you have the overlapping so you have to decide for the six pulse converter okay what you have to decide that the overlapping can vary less than 60 equal to 60 and more than the 60 accordingly you have to choose the formula and then you have to just put the value of that and solve okay so one by one we will start for that and let's start with the first one so this is the numerical number one which is shown here so i am starting with the, that is the transformer secondary obviously we will have the transformer secondary and where the where it is connected or you can see the six pulse conversion is because okay and because uh, on the primary side we have the main supply on the secondary side we have the conversion okay so line voltage okay line voltage of the bridge rectifier that is equal to 345 kV that is a ELL. I can write ELL. ELL. Or you can write the VLL. So don't be confused with these formulas. Both are same. That is so uh, that the uh, thing you have to uh, keep in mind that is it is the line to line voltage. Line to line voltage. Line to line voltage. Okay. Now, if I talk about the DC voltage output, uh, the DC voltage output with the mu is uh, 15 degrees. So it is interesting because look at this. If the mu is equal to 15 degree, so it is lying in the range for the mode. So if we if we talk about the mode, then we had the three types of mode we have discussed: first, second, and third. If we talk about the first mode, then it is uh, for the less than 60 degree, second mode equal to 60 degree. So it is less than 60 degree. It is for equal to 60 degree and it is for the greater than 60 degree. This is the abnormal condition we have discussed. Okay, so it is a kind of lying in the mode number one. If it is lying in the mode number one, then we will have the formula like this. That is the VD is equal to, that is the VD naught by two cos alpha plus cos alpha plus mu. Where is the alpha is your firing angle? Where is the alpha is your firing angle? Firing angle and mu is your overlapping. Okay, now we will move for the alpha. That is the alpha is equal, A is equal to 0 degree, B is equal to 15 degree and C is equal to 30 degree. It means that we, had, we are having the three cases which are 0 degree, 15 degree and 30 degree. So now I will start as we have the overlapping angle, the 15 degree given and the VLL, that is the line to line voltage is given 345 kilovolt. It is already mentioned. Now, if I use this formula, then I will go for the point number A, that is when the alpha is equal to zero degree. If I put the alpha is equal to zero degree, then VD is equal to 233 cos zero degree plus cos zero plus 15 degree. So cos zero is actually your one. So I will put it here one and cos 15 degrees. So cos it will be zero plus 15. So it will be cos 15. So if I calculate why 233 come, because the VD naught by two. As the VD naught, your VD naught. Okay, so VD naught, we will calculate from here. That is actually three root two upon pi VLL, or you can write the ELL. Okay, no need to be worried for that. You can write VLL or you can write the ELL. And after the solving for that, you will have the 466 kilovolt. Okay, guys, now we will move. So after the solving, this is the 233. This is a 233 into 1 plus cos 15. And then you will have the 455 kilovolt. And uh, after the calculation of that. Now, if I talk about the B is equal to the point number B. If the alpha is equal to 15 degree, mu is remaining same, same that is operating in the mode number one. So if I use the alpha is equal to 15 degree, so it will be the VD, same formula, VD naught cos alpha plus cos alpha plus mu. And then after putting these values, you will get 466 by two cos 15, because the alpha is equal to 15 and 15 plus 15, it will be 30. So you have to calculate by, Firstly, you have to calculate cos 15, then calculate the cos 30. After the calculation and after the multiplication with the 233. 
you will get 426.8 kilovolt okay now if i talk about if i talk about if i talk about the point number c same cheese uh, same thing is uh, u is equal to that is uh, which is given u is equal to 15 degree and if i talk about the alpha alpha is equal to 30 degree so when you will put in this formula so you can get the vd is equal to vd naught by 2 and this will be cos alpha plus cos alpha plus mu or you can say the u that is a similar thing if we talk about the vd naught by 2 so we have already calculated that is the 233 and cos here here it will be cos alpha and what is the cos alpha alpha is actually 30 degrees so i will calculate the first cos 30 degree value then i will calculate the cos 30 plus u what is the u 15 30 plus 15 that is equal to 45 degree and after the solving for this i will get i am having the answer for that that is the 2366.5 kilo volt so in this way you have to solve these numericals and it is actually a very easy uh, first numerical if i talk about so i hope this numerical you have understood so tata bye bye and thank you